What's up y'all, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm doing a back to school supplies haul. So this year I'm going to be a sophomore in high school. I was about to say freshman, but nah, I was a freshman last year. This year I'm going to be a sophomore. Bought some, some, I just bought some supplies from the store, obviously. The past two years I've always like bought a whole bunch of supplies that I never even used. Alright. So sis, I need to plug in my headphones just so y'all can really hear me crisp and clear. Alright, y'all can hear me real good? Yeah, that's what I thought so. Basically, I'm just going to be showing all the supplies that I got for my sophomore year. And yeah, so without further ado, let's get started. The first things I, I bought were these two books. And these are actually for summer reading. And this first book is called Into Thin Air. And then the second book is called Copper Sun. The reason why I kept looking to the side. The reason why I kept looking to the side and stuff was because I had I was using my back camera and my mirror was right in front of my phone. So I was able to like see myself through my mirror, you know? Hopefully that made sense. But anyways, continue. Nothing really special. I just have to buy these books because I have to read them. And they're gonna test us like the first week of school. So on to my supplies. All right, so this is just one two inch binder. It's a real cute, y'all. Like, look at the inside. It's like a really pretty turquoise, maybe, whatever. Okay. It has like a pineapple design on it, and inside the pineapple, there's like flowers. Don't mind my nails, y'all, all right? I really apologize that y'all have to see this, but I'm gonna be getting my, nail my nails done soon, and I just can't pop these nails off. Like, I literally have one nail on this hand. Yeah. But y'all, it's okay. But yeah, it just has another pineapple on the back. It's a very cute. Can you close the door? Okay, can you close the door? Yeah, but I wanna see you. <laughs> that was a no. I'm about to rip these eyelashes off. So the next binder I'm gonna show y'all is this floral one. Um, it's also a two inch binder and it's the same color in the inside as the other one. And this binder will probably come in handy for like, I don't know, a science class or something. The next thing I'm gonna show y'all are these two composition notebooks. I just got two black and white ones because I know that there's gonna be at least one or two teachers that only want composition notebooks, nothing else, just composition notebooks. So yeah, got that. The next thing um, are these, two, are actually these two spiral notebooks. I bought this one because it really caught my eye and it also like matches the binder. And then here is just this regular, smegular, white. Uh, hold up, hold up. Did I just say smegular? Oh, hell no. Uh, oh my gosh. My eyes are watering. This notebook is just a three subject notebook. It's five star. And um, it's free subject. Yeah, I already said that. Oh, and it's college rule. All my notebooks and my papers are college rule because my handwriting looks way much better in college rule. My handwriting looks way better in college rule. This is just my paper. It comes with 150. I bought two packs. Next is um, I got some folders. I really like keeping folders in my backpack because they're just really reliable. Last year I only had one folder and it was the paper kind so it was like all torn up and ripped and it was just horrible. The folders are like made out of cardboard, paper, fuck. I'm pretty sure they're like cardboard or paper. Anyways yeah I like to stay away from those type of folders because um, I feel like these won't rip and fall apart as easily. So I got three of these in blue, white, and green, as you can see. Next, I got these pocket, not pocket, not pocket. I got these dividers. I bought one pack of these floral ones, and they're reversible. If you were to not want the floral design, you could just reverse it, and it'll be a solid color. Next, I got these dividers. I don't remember if I showed y'all, but I got some index cards just so I can like write down any notes. Next. 
I bought highlighters, pencils, and pens. You know, I didn't buy a lot because I honestly, I can, I keep up with my pencils and stuff, and I use mechanical pencils, so I just need to keep on buying lead if anything. I just bought these, these ones. It comes with how many does it come with? Six. It comes with six, and yeah. I really like these. I feel like these will last like at least a whole year. The other mechanical pencils I bought were these. It comes with extra lead and two erasers just in case I need a refill. I can't wait to use these like. I bought one pack of two gel pens. I don't use um, pens a lot, but I know that I'm going to have one class that requires to have a black pen. So yeah, I just picked these up. And then I also bought some highlighters. I don't really use highlighters like that, but I know in my English class, they're gonna have to highlight a lot because we read like a lot of articles and stuff. The last three things I bought were this calculator, um, you know, for math class, obviously. I just picked it up because it's the only one that I saw. And then I also bought a pencil sharpener. This is actually my dad's. <laughs> he actually picked it up and put it in the car. I need to get that to him. And then I also got a ruler because this will really come in handy if I ever want to draw straight lines. I'm not. All right, so that is all I. Oh wait. Okay, so that is all I bought. But um, I didn't buy a book bag because I'm just gonna use the book bag that I used last year, and this book bag is still in good um condition. So I just didn't. I just decided not to buy a new one. This book bag is just um a Victoria's Secret pink. And it's just gray and black and it's really good it's really simple and it has four pockets and it has the see-through side pockets I really like the see-through side pockets because the side pockets that like aren't see-through I always put stuff in there and then I end up forgetting it's like sits in my bag for like the whole year and I and then when I go to clear out my book bag, I find it and I was like, oh, here, here's what, here's where my lip gloss went or here's where this went or, you know, this is going to be my book bag this year, even though I used it last year, but I mean, who cares? All right, so let me try to make this thumbnail. So that is the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed this first video of my back to school series. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm pretty sure I already said that. Um, what else do I have to say? Oh, follow my social medias. They might be up here somewhere. Oh, and by the way, I start school the 12th. Let me know down below when y'all start school. Yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.